Hi there. Now in this question, we're asked to differentiate x to the power 5 plus 6 root x, all divided by 2x squared. So if you'd like to have a go at this one, haven't done so already, as usual, just give you a moment to pause the video. When you come back, I'll take you through the work solution. OK, welcome back then if you had a go. So again, with this, you can set this out in several ways. I like to generally set it out as let some variable, let's say we call it y, equal x to the power 5 plus 6 root x, and then all of this is divided by 2x squared. Now, to differentiate this, we need to break this up into two terms. And when you've got a division like this, one way is to just divide each of the terms on the top by the single term on the bottom. So we've got x to the power 5 then divided by 2x squared. And then we've got plus 6. And when it comes to root x, I'm going to change that to x to the power half. Should be OK with that. If not, just check out my tutorials on indices. OK, so we've broken it up into two terms. Now we need to simplify each of these two terms. So subtracting the powers here, we end up with x cubed. OK, 5 take away the 2. And so what we've got is a half x cubed. Or you could write x cubed over 2. It's up to you. And for this one, 6 divided by 2 is 3. And then if we subtract the powers, a half take away 2 is minus 1 and a half, or better still, write it as minus 3 over 2. Now we're in a position to differentiate this, so therefore dy by dx equals, and in the usual way, multiply the power with the number in front, so you've got 3 times a half, which is 3 over 2. Try and avoid changing it to 1 and a half, OK? And then just reduce the power by 1, so that's x squared. For the next one, don't rush in and write a plus, because minus 3 over 2 times 3 is going to be minus 9 over 2. Then subtract 1 from the power, and you've got x to the power minus 5 over 2. And you could leave it like that, OK? It's quite acceptable. Or I'll clean it up for you further, OK? Just good practice anyway. That is that dy by dx equals, well, we've got the 3 over 2x squared. But for this term here, because we've got the negative power, we can take that down the bottom and change it to a positive power by the negative reciprocal rule. And that is 2 times x to the power 5 over 2. But as I say, you didn't need to write it as that. This is quite acceptable. Now there's another way that we could set this question out that you might have tried. OK, so we'll just put or here. And that is by just using this notation, d by dx of the function that we're given, which is x to the power 5 plus 6 root x then, all divided by 2x squared. And if you did this, all you're going to do is do really much the same as what we did over here. Just simplify it, as I did with all these stages here, to bring you down to a half x cubed plus 3x to the power minus 3 over 2. And then when you differentiate each of the terms, you're going to get exactly what we had before. So just showing you really another way of presenting that, OK? And you could leave it like that, or you could write it in as that one. So I hope it's given you some idea then how to set that problem out and how to do it. OK?